Welcome back guys to Fire Emblem, where after dealing with Desai, Celica moves on grief next. Critical Saber! No such luck. I mean, you can definitely kill that guy. But I'm worried about you against the other one. You'll take another level. All right, leave them all to me. A little bit of extra defense, but your attack growth seems to be stupid. Oh, that was the boss one. Okay. That was the boss. Let's heal up Atlas. I owe you one. Yeah, we... let's not jinx it, as someone else said. But so far, we've been having fairly decent levels, haven't we? Uh, I really needed that. No, you didn't. You're going to heal back all that HP lost like, on the next turn. He's going to attack Atlas, because that makes sense. He's got a critical chance, so he could actually kill Atlas. He didn't know. And he could double Atlas. But Atlas has learned Wrath Strike. Right. Now, how do we engineer your demise in the nicest way possible? Don't crit now, Leon. Right, I don't think Selic is anywhere near to leveling up just yet. The best thing for me to do is to white magic. Ah, that's all the way back up. Oh, thanks. No problem, Alice. We're making you level up and get into useful person status. Selica could kill the guy, but. Almost a definite hit. That is a definite hit. I mean, that's fine for me to go for Wrath Strike him, to be honest. Now I double. Or something along those lines. Oh, I get doubled. But he'll get the kill. So there's nothing really more we need to discuss here. Maybe he might even level up again. Ooh. Well, the reinforcement encounter actually made us stronger. <laughs> serves them right. Ser serves them right, it does. You're right, they are served. Now, no reinforcements appear on, at, you know, like, Alan's path, and we're all good. It's time to take on grief. Let's do this. With Celica gaining a little bit more rating as well. Before we do that, because now I've remembered, let's get that support that I missed. So it was with Forsyth and Python, I did it off camera like an idiot. So let's get that heard first of all. Python. Oh, Python. Krabbins, here he comes again. What is it now, Forsyth? Don't give me that innocent mummery act. Do you think I'm not watching you? Sir Alm and the others are fighting five times as hard as you are. You're barely even pretending to try. Have you no honor or shame? Shame? Nope, sorry, not feeling it. But good on that lot for keeping at it. You know, it's high past time I told you a number of... Whoops, here comes the enemy. Gotta skedaddle now. Ta-ta! Python? Come back here at once! <sighs> he simply does not get it. Now, you've got to imagine, with this battle with, um, Grief, there's got to be a lot of enemies. Units 20, that's why the rating is so high. The rating for Desai was a lot lower, but then it had a gimmick to the battle. I'm hoping no more reinforcements appear now. We've got a Gazelle. We've got Tatala. 
See, the rating past Lawson isn't so big, but then again, Lawson has 20, and it's the forest again. Depending on where the position of our guys, things could be quite nasty. Again, 868 rating ain't high. 711. We have to go back to the town to get back up that way. And it seems there's a promotion point for each of us when we go in. But now it's time to do it. Yeah, if I get level ups like those, ambushes are good. Attack on Grief Citadel. Grief, boss! That girl and her band of idiots are here. Ugh, what the hell are the rest of the men doing? I need them here to fight. Um, it doesn't look like they're moving, boss. What? Damn it. So I've been betrayed, have I? Uh, fine. Just fine. I'll just go out there and crush this stupid girl all by myself. God, what are you saying about the guard's voice? The guard's voice is the best voice. Alright, no one's sneaking around us. It's a massive castle! Which is... No, well they got fire, not thunder, so that removes a bit of the critical strike chance, I guess. But literally they could warp on someone like Valbar, can they, and kill him outright? Yeah, I'm not even kidding. They could very kill Valbar. He's got two res because I've equipped him with the Rion shield. Oh, wait a second, the Rion shield. Isn't that a quest item? <laughs> I'm confused now. What am I hunting for again? We've got a random Myrmidon off to the side, so essentially we need to keep Valbar safe until we've killed these witches. Whenever they decide to walk. We've got a sniper here. So, oh, this is going to be a Maya Mage. It's essentially Leon's job again, basically. Switch Leon to the front. Sniper. Mirror Sniper. Maya. Wow, this is a long range battle, isn't it? The problem are these guys. And then we head further in, we got Grief. A Cantor. Believe it or not. Grief has 20 speed. It's something that improves his res with 12 defense. That's ridiculous! So we can double pretty much everyone. But Valbar can take a hit. We obviously need Valbar somewhere near the front. But, uh... And, the, and the, yeah, the Pegasi is somewhere near the back. I don't like the look of this bell. I think we're going to have to use well, the turmoil. Looky here! It's Sophia's crowd princess! Ain't you just fancy? How? Who told you that? Well, let me think a second. Who could it have been? You know what? It don't matter. Fact is, I owe you my thanks. While you royals were lounging about, ignoring your own kingdom, I was becoming a very rich man. You people turned Sophia into a place where only the strong survive. Hell, now it's the spitting image of Regal itself, don't you think? You may think yourself something fine, but your days as a predator are done! Who are those women? Ugh, witches. What? This whole thing is a bit out of my realm of expertise. But, apparently, offering up your soul to Duma buys you enormous magic power. Problem is, you basically turn into a living husk sort of... Uh, thing. That's horrific. It's also why the Empire's so strong. I'm sure the Deliverance has its hands full. Um... Witches! Witchy, witchy, witches! Witchy, witchy, witches! Don't like them at all, but we're first of all going to engage in a sniper battle! Because why on earth not? 17 attack does that guy have? Versus you. It's because he's got a better bow. How dare he. Alright, so he's got 5 speed, 17 attack. It's going to hit Leon for a bit. But Leon will be able to deal. The real question is, do I want to get in range of Maya Mage too? Probably not. I'll handle this myself. 
I mean, I probably could clear out some guys faster if I did that. But we need someone to deal with this Myrmidon this away. With a fair attack rating on him. Probably best if Kamui goes. Alright, I'll handle this. Essentially, we need to keep Valbar safe within a pack in some senses here. Basically, any of these mages could completely destroy Valbar. So that really sucks. We kind of have to hope they warp in some really stupid places so that we can pick them off before they come in. I think it's Valbar who's most under threat. The difference is for other people is they have speed ratings. Do you know what? Go, my incredibly slow minions! Be meat shields of random. I need two hits. I need a crit, really, but. So he's gonna retreat on the next turn back, so I need to kill him off. Oh no, you're gonna get healed! What an annoying plonker! Ah! If I didn't invoke, she would have gone for actual people. Oh, she's gonna get killed by the invoke guys. Yeah, kill her! She's a witch, we don't like her. Oh, my invoke guys are gonna die. <laughs> My god, these witches. I mean, this is a loss of experience because the witch will die to the guys. Because basically she's killed herself by using fire. So that sucks. But that's one less witch to attack Valbar. Can't say I really mind. Right, we know who we're going for next. Critical Leon. No. Oh, he missed as well. Will we get someone retreating or not? That's my next question. I actually wanted to invoke again. I can't believe I'm saying it, but that's actually probably the best thing for me to do. I really needed that. Just as witch lures? Which way am I going with you, Valbar? Because no matter which way I go, there's a mage waiting. Frankly, sucks quite a bit. The real problem is I can only really send Leon up one path as well. I need people who can range these guys down. But Leon's the only one who can really do it reliably, reliably. Leads to some fairly interesting strategy, doesn't it? That's my Valbar protection bait. And now we've set up the other battle. Will the Valbar protection bait work? It is, Leon. Nicely done. Now, hopefully, the My Mage... Oh, the My Mage is actually in range. This guy's got a crit chance! 
Okay, he needs to die. Oh, here we go. You can't invoke things, it's my job. All oh, these witches are actually coming in. I think Leon is in range to take on a witch. But only one witch. He kind of has to do it, doesn't he? Yeah. Come on, Liam. Nice. Leon! We've moved Leon also in range of the Mario Mage. Did I get stronger again? Goodness. Because he's trying to build up his crit and hit now. Ish. So you can reach to there. You've got a 13... You've got a 12 spell attack and 13 speed. This is my 11 res. Let's give the witch a target. There's tons of invokes to kill. The other thing that has to be done here. So I have to kill this guy. We have multiple people who can get into hits with people. Hey, honey. Hello. Do you have a mug I can put tea into? Hmm? Is there a mug I can put tea into for you? No, there is not. I have not got a current active mug. Do you want me to get the washing machine? Uh, when, yeah. I mean, yes. Watch out for the floor. I've already dealt with that little kitty maid situation. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. All the bits I could see. Anyway. All the giblets. Hi, Becca, everyone's going. Hello, living maid. Living maid. <laughs> Ass bag, is that who I am? I don't want this guy to have a crit rating against me, basically, but it's, it's there. And I can't just not have it happen. So well, that should be enough for Katria to come back and finish the job and survive it. She can't be crit. She's got a better crit chance after all the luck she's got. Get yourself healed already. Katria! Why did you do that? I actually have to turn well that one. Basically, the guy's going to retreat, right? He's he's not going to stick around and attack anyone, most likely. But Katri is on too low HP to actually, like, heal up and move if the guy doesn't go back. Well, that's problematic. If I put someone into a stupid position, now they can't survive it. Because Katria couldn't finish the job. I'm ready for anything. You do have thunder, don't you? Is there any way we can move you? No one's got swap or anything. Apart from the one person we need to do other things. That's a shame. Cheaty turn wheel. The thing is, we might have to use it again because if he doesn't run away, he will run away. There's no way he's staying. But if he doesn't, we're in big trouble. The guy can double. The guy can double Pala to near death, I think. And can double Bowie to again near death. And if he procs a crit, then we're in really big trouble. And if I leave, if I left her here, even with physics, and I'm in trouble anyway. <laughs> Feeling good. Camille, you're gonna need to back her up. I'll blow him down. 
Can that guy not move forward like a space? That's his maximum attack range, is it? Somehow I still doubt that. And I can't trust Catra to get the final kill, even though me moving other people should have reset the RNG a little bit. That's really annoying. Right, this is what we wanted. If Leon dodges is even better. Because Leon can move on to new targets now. We pulled the witch. Yeah. Like 100% he was going to run, so we were safe, but I didn't want to take the chance. So technically, it's actually a wasted turn. Wait, you can reach again? I forgot about you guys. You really ran up there, didn't you? I think she's going to survive them. Thank you for patting me in the face. Yay, she didn't die. Best result. I guess it's kind of up to Parla to try and finish this off, really. Do what your sister could not. Nicely done. Katria, we wasted a charge of turn wheel on you. Right, next up. Is, well, first of all, we need to just kill this lady, which isn't going to be too hard. The next other problem is this guy. Can Valbar even get to that position? I don't think he can, you know. Who's the best one to take this on? You better level up, can we? I saw the witches off the board. Is your ride open? It's Eisen! Huh? No, I guess not. No, it's not Eisen. You're wide open! Right, these these goons are gonna get in my way now, aren't they? Oh well. Things we do for an easy life. Ready anytime. Time for us to begin our advance proper again. You can get there, can't you? Right, so essentially we're probably going up one side rather than both. You mean I can physic my invoke creatures? Pat the bold spot for good luck, you gets. There we go. A level up. My skills on the battlefield are improving. Some extra crit chance ish. Alright. I know you're at my service. Can you actually hit your targets? Because you're usually the good one. I mean no one can really get in on me here. I mean the real question is this guy. Should we just squeeze up one side? Out my way, guys. Because we need Leon to take care of the mages. We need to go the other side as well. There's experience over there, you know? This is where the invoked creatures block my way, isn't it? No, he's actually... He is blocking my way. I'm at the top of my game. But in a different, more annoying fashion. Huh? Yeah! Ha-ha! Yeah. 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 You stealing my spotlight? How dare she? We got options. Try that again. How'd you miss? 
Well, he's got a higher crit chance, hit chance than you. How'd that come about? Oh, I can move to there, nice. You better finish the job there that he could not do. This is the side we're advancing on, and Valbar can't even get to the front line. Oh, sorry. Valbar is locked out of the ball game here, thanks to my invokes. Is there anyone really to heal at this point? I may as well keep the hill train going. You're the best. You're the best. Well, we've got no time limit for this level. Well, uh, or an enforced time limit. Thank you. Genny could never betray us in such a way. Don't be silly. I can't really push up really anymore. I mean, we're at a point where we could besiege this guy, but then there's an archer backing him up. So it's like... We're full of bad things that can happen. Like this. Like that guy having a critical hit chance. Like more Cantored Beasties. Five that time. Six, is that actually? Or have they just not, someone just not started? Oh, that guy's coming. Now, oh, Valbar, it looks like you're gonna have to turn around. Hey, my summon beasties don't hold a candle to their summon beasties. This is not appropriate. Well, Leon's going to get some criticals, isn't he? Criticals, Leon. I do appreciate your dodges. The hits are pretty good, too. Alright, I can't reach to kill... Well, I can reach to kill the archer. It's just as it's super advisable. Ah, is Cheers working yet? I think I'll answer that question for you. So you've got more res or less res? Less res. No! I don't even know, man. I'm not having a good day with uh, my Pegasus Knights. It's a bit too easy to scroll over what you need to be using, I find. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. It's not the cheers that distracted me, it was other things. I can't even kill that guy in one. I have to turn well again to re-correct that mistake. I mean, most likely he's going to run away. The one that's most under worry is... It's Leon. <sighs> I can force people to run away, but there are people who've just got into positions that I really don't want them to be in. I mean, these guys aren't too strong. 
basically the archer and this guy here. Just one slip of a button can screw you over so badly, it's ridiculous. So I'll just have a go of it. This is a fight I can't lose. I'm glad you leveled up. Would you like to gain some res while you're at it? You might need it. Landing the first strike is a fine feeling indeed. Some pretty good stat ups. You both can now be attacked by Mr. Meyer Mage. I do not admire him. To be honest though, they're gonna go for the stupid little guys, aren't they? Well, the only thing I don't like is the fact that he's got that crit chance on him. One little wrong button press. One wrong button press. Back. And it messes you up so much, it's ridiculous. And also these invoke people. It's hoping the crit chance would come in there, but that should cause him to run. I think we can keep playing as is. I can't just redo every little slip of the buttons I do. No, I kind of want to. <laughs> and guess what? A hundred candles pop out of the basement. I don't need that in my life. <laughs> that weird moment where it's actually a good idea to switch May for this guy here. Apart from skill, I think your skill rating versus their skill rating is part of what ha what rates for critical, I think. Well, someone could die. It's most likely they're not going to, but that turn sucked. Well, first, that one's going to go down. Yeah, he ran. He ran good. We're perfectly fine. Just due to order of attack. We're going to have to deal with the critical strike chance that the guy had. Essentially, I, I worry too much. But that's my job. Yeah, you go, guy. I can't even get in range with that guy. We can get in thunder range, but by if I look, if I step there, oh, that does come up with his thingy stuff. All right, Selica, it's time for you to start trying to whittle some people down for me. He's gonna go for this guy next anyway, so we don't have to worry there anymore. This is the one we need to worry about. So we're going to start from the back. Fire does take him out of one. How's that? Great, right? We can start moving up this side now. Hopefully the boss stays where he is though. Because I need to face that massive melee of people in a second. It feels like these maps were set as like boss maps. So it's like, you have to deal with these guys now. There is no other way about it. You are now stuck dealing with this guy. This guy's going around the corner. And there's a healing pot in the middle of the room. So he's going to actually end up in range of... He's going to end up in range of Leon again. So his death is assured. So go clever boy him. Yeah, I'm going to have to take you on with... Katria. Katria's just got the hit rating for it. And a bit more res to go with it. I wasn't 
impressed. Right, so we've got rid of one side's defences. You hated this boss. Yeah. Well, in most circumstances, all people are going to have fun with everything at this point. You never know, you might get a critical. I don't think anyone's going to turn back and try to attack you at this point, so... Give it a go. You tried. It's all I could really ask. Just wondering if, if I can chase that guy down. I might be able to, weirdly enough. Well, there's the crit again. Gorgeous. Here's the question. Do I throw myself in here? Or do I... What's your range today? Quite far. I mean, I can feel this... Finish this guy off. With the Sunder, yeah. What's your highest accuracy attack? Crossways cut? Probably best to go for that, then. Or do I try to take out the other side's defences as well? Because we've got a left side with a Mario Mage and an Archer as well. 